As a follow-up to the video I did about living with less, I thought I would offer a few strategies about how you can reduce some of the clutter in your own life. And the best strategy that I've found is actually to start boxing things up that you haven't been using and then set the box aside and put a timetable on when you're going to get rid of it. And so, I mean, let's say that if you don't use things for 90 days, you're going to get rid of them. And so then you uh, kind of put a timetable on it. And if nothing in the box gets used for 90 days, don't even reopen the box. Just take it uh, straight to wherever you might donate goods. Or if it's a bunch of things that you wanted to sell on eBay, then get the auctions ready to go and start selling the stuff. Uh, the second thing is to look through your stuff and see how many duplicates you have. I mean, you might be surprised. I had a friend who once had three vacuum cleaners. Who needs three vacuum cleaners? If you got extra stuff, get rid of it. That's a great way to cut down on the amount of stuff you have. And you might make an excuse that you need more than one of something, but really, in most cases, you probably don't. And the third thing is, set a rule for yourself that every time you buy something, there's something else that you're going to give up and get rid of. And if you do that, you you uh, eliminate the possibility of things starting to accumulate. So if you get a new computer, uh, put a plan in place to get rid of the old computer. If you get some new appliance, figure out what you're going to do or what you're going to give up instead. Even if you get books, donate the books, get rid of the books, and then uh, you won't have so many things. It's a great strategy. It works. I've tried it. Maybe it'll work for you too.